Center at UBC. Thank you for joining us tonight to celebrate an exceptional year at the University of British Columbia. This is a year that has included the launch of a renewed strategic plan, place and promise, the UBC plan, which is being released to the public for the first time tonight, and a new public identity for UBC, UBC a place of mind. Annual reports, strategic plans, ordinarily the stuff of boardrooms and AGMs rather than theaters and concert halls, but tonight is different. Tonight, there's a reason for the fanfare. These are opportunities for us to tell UBC's story anew. And tonight is a night of story and song. Here on this stage, you're going to see the pages of our annual report come to life. You'll hear stories of student, staff, and faculty accomplishments in teaching and learning, research and service to the community, all told through the magic of theater and technology. Over and over again, you'll see why we call UBC a place of mind. The document that we will give you at the end of the evening is as much a souvenir program as it is an annual report, and it will serve to remind you of all that UBC is capable of when we think and imagine and create as a community. Tonight is also a night to give thanks. There were thousands of people who took time to contribute their insight and expertise to the drafting of place and promise. The renewed strategic plan that sets UBC's course for the next few years. I want to take this opportunity to thank in particular the university's board of governors as well as UBC's vice presidents for their work in bringing place and promise into being to two board members who complete their terms of service this year, Dr. Aaron Garr and Mr. Jim Eckett, my gratitude for your tremendous contributions to the university. Would the Vice President and the Board of Governors please stand so that we may acknowledge you. version of it online. I hope that when you think of this place in the coming year, you'll bring to mind this theater on this dark December night, lit from within by all the passion, commitment, and curiosity it will take to make the discoveries and breakthroughs of 2010. I hope that you will also think of this place and you'll think not only of Point Grey and the Okanagan campuses, but also of the UBC-supported clinics and hospitals around the province whose lights are on this evening, and of the UBC learning exchanges in the downtown east side and in Kelowna, whose doors are open tonight. And I hope that when you think of the promise you will think of all that this place of mind can yet become, and all that UBC's students, staff, faculty, and alumni, including community supporters, can yet learn, can yet discover, can yet contribute, each one of us in our own way.